Sound and Pictures coverage of Cinegear Expo is sponsored by Able Cine. Uh. the Radiant Images booth at Cinegear Expo. I'm here with Cyrus, and he's going to talk to us about the Novo. Please tell us. Hi, Lauren. OK, well, this is a very compact version of um, basically Cinestyle camera. What we did basically for this camera was we took the GoPro 3 4K and we modified the housing. Uh, we moved the lens to a center, center of the actual housing. So now, we, by doing that, we achieved uh, interchangeable different lenses. We put different mounts on there, different lenses. Uh, you get a selection of 12 C-mount lenses that you can actually apply to this camera. Uh, one of the cool features in our camera also is we have quarter 20 screws underneath it so you can mount it anywhere with your standard cine accessories. Mm -hmm. uh, so mounting becomes a lot easier. Also in this configuration, this camera particularly is getting powered by the monitor. So we kind of reverse and flip the actual roll mm -hmm. versus camera powering of the monitor. Sure. So basically that's what we're doing with this setup. There's multiple different setups that you can have this camera configured at. Uh, one of the really cool features that we're excited about is uh, locking the auto exposure. So now if you go from the dark to the bright environment, you don't have that flickering happening, which you will with the GoPro. Mm -hmm. We can lock the exposure and we can use the iris control as your exposure control, just like a cine style cameras, basically. Um, there's also another thing, by moving the lens mount to the center, you don't have that bowing effect anymore. As you can see, it's pretty square image all the way across. Nice and clean, it's very sharp. Mm -hmm. And uh, again, it does all the good things that GoPro does, plus more. Um, so what would be some practical applications for this? Then? Well, practical applications, let's say you were in an airplane fuselage and you have very limited area of space. And basically with this configuration, you can just go in there and just carry it around and just record what you need, pull your scene off and take your shots off. Everything comes out to the media card. Media card is just standard. You can just basically pull it out and there's your media card. And uh, basically, that's what it is. There is an IR filter also in the lens, so it'll cut off the IR. And um, it doesn't basically, um, you can adjust back focus on this. Once you set your back focus, you can actually mount your lenses on it. We'll do that on the factory on the spot for you, so. Is it available now? Absolutely. It's on several, several different shows, you know, and uh, uh, there around the world, actually, we have a, a, one of our uh, suppliers is in PNS Technique in Germany. So they have several of these cameras that are on the shows, yes. And how much would something like this go for? Uh, the camera alone by itself is $299, and lenses are each $100 a piece. Mm -hmm a day rental basically for it. But you know, it all depends on the size of the package and how many do you want. We go from there basically. <gasps> Wonderful Cyrus, thank you so much for taking the time. Absolutely, my pleasure. If you want to find out more about this or any of their other products, please visit radiantimages.com.